Hello, this is Scott Bacchano from telecoms.com. I'm here at Qualcomm HQ in San Diego. And um, I'm talking to Raul Patel, who's the GM of Connectivity and Networking. Now, Raul, you just did a presentation earlier, and quite a lot of it was focused on Wi-Fi 6. So I've got to admit, I've written about Wi-Fi 6, but I could do with a bit of a refresher as to what the sort of new features are, what's exciting about it. So why don't you start by telling us about that? Thank you, Scott. I think welcome to Qualcomm. Um, Wi-Fi 6 is the newest, latest generation of Wi-Fi. It is uh, four times more in performance, be it throughput or creating capacity for the same medium that you have in Wi-Fi 5, and the range also improves dramatically up to 2x, two times. So those are the big attributes that you know, the consumers are going to experience with Wi-Fi 6. But the other attributes uh, that are unique in Wi-Fi 6 that has not been in the previous generation on handheld devices, because of certain features that Qualcomm has implemented, specifically target wake time, when you are connected to an access point, your battery life experience improves by 60%, up to 60%. So those are the key attributes of Wi-Fi 6, and it's even more valuable as more and more Wi-Fi radios get deployed for the same medium that we have to work with for the last you know, a decade or so, there's a lot of congestion. And so modulation techniques that have been deployed, deployed by Wi-Fi 6 are more, much more efficient than the previous generations of Wi-Fi, making better utilization of the medium that you have to work with. So Wi-Fi 6 has a tremendous amount of promise for improvement in consumer experience, has tremendous amount of promise in delivering you know, high throughputs at further ranges than previous generations of Wi-Fi and uh, also uh, be the technology that is going to differentiate significantly in congested environments where many people or many Wi-Fi devices are trying to source the medium at the same time. Okay, that uh, sums it up pretty well. Um, I generally associate historically uh, Qualcomm with sort of cellular connectivity, but I know you, I mean, you recently had a day devoted to Wi-Fi 6. Can you tell us a little bit more about why Qualcomm's uh, devoting so much resource to this? Yes. Uh, you're absolutely right. Qualcomm is definitely a worldwide leader when it comes to cellular modem. Qualcomm is also definitely in a significant lead on 5G, which is the big thing in the cellular world. Having said that, you know, a little known fact, but uh, a major fact in my opinion is that Qualcomm ships over a billion Wi-Fi devices annually. In the last uh, four years or so, we've shipped in access of four billion Wi-Fi devices. And in, if you look at uh, the Wi-Fi market in general, uh, annually, give or take some three to three and a half billion Wi-Fi devices ship, and of which, of which Qualcomm is uh, over a billion Wi-Fi devices, we have a significant lead pool position in terms of the total shipments in the marketplace. And so, making sure we are leading the market on a going forward basis, and that comes only if we are going to deliver the best in class experience for our customers. These billions of devices or four plus billion devices in the last four years is uh, going to be very essential to Qualcomm's leadership on a going forward basis. And so Wi-Fi 6 and leading Wi-Fi 6 on many fronts, uh, access points. Recently in San Francisco, we had a Wi-Fi 6 day and any uh, major brand name that you can think of was on the stage with Qualcomm talking about Wi-Fi 6 importance of Wi-Fi 6, Qualcomm's technology in their products. You have over 150 designs coming in the cellular world that are using Qualcomm Wi-Fi 6. We have shipped over 500 million devices in the last year or so on the handset side that are Wi-Fi 5, but have some features of Wi-Fi 6, what we call as Wi-Fi 6 ready capable. So they devi these devices, before the Wi-Fi 6 certification came about, are there in the marketplace but are able to have a connection with Wi-Fi 6 access point and get best in the class performance, better than that what they would have with Wi-Fi 5. So a lot of good things Qualcomm has put in motion over the years to get to where we are right now with Wi-Fi 6, and it's extremely valuable for Qualcomm that we deliver best in class technology to our customers, and billions of you know, units that we shipped any annually. Okay, and, and then just to finish off, um, you did speak earlier on about how uh, Wi-Fi 6 and 5G are quite complementary to each other. Perhaps you could just tell us a little bit more about why they are and, and why, why that's important. Yes, I think 5G uh, takes the performance level of the cellular networks to a newer height. 
Wi-Fi 6 does exactly that for a Wi-Fi. So pairing up best-in-class technologies from the cellular world with the unlicensed spectrum, which is Wi-Fi 6, is very obvious. And as, at Qualcomm, uh, or rather in this world, who better than Qualcomm to bring these two things together? You would have fixed wireless access, which is the new way of uh, sourcing broadband using wireless technology versus what traditionally has been done in most parts of the world is wired broadband. Now you have 5G that rivals fiber speeds with millimeter wave capabilities. It can pair up with Wi-Fi 6, which can deliver you know, significant improvement in throughputs, hundreds of megabits at various parts of your home at distances that you would not have imagined getting that kind of performance. So you have a nice pairing. If you look at your phones, for example, if you're going to have 5G in your phone, the performance levels that you expect in those phones with 5G have to be matched with the Wi-Fi performance. And Wi-Fi 6 definitely, again, is very complimentary when you get into a local area network setting to match what you are going to experience with cellular. And I can go on and on, but those are the two big marketplaces where you'll see 5G and Wi-Fi 6 go hand in hand. What I say, they are tied to the hip of each other, basically. Okay, that's great. Thank you very much. Thank you, Scott. Thank you for having uh, you at Qualcomm, too.